passes under and grabs my own wrist to complete the key lock, Americana or figure four on bar. From here, like I'm painting the mat, I'm going to drag his arm down. Look, I'm not lifting up. If I just lift up right here, there's no action there. There's no uh, key lock. No. The way to do it, I'm going to drag, drag, and take what I call the slack out of the arm. Now, if you notice, as I'm dragging across the tatami mat, now I start elevating and lifting. And there's my tap out for the Americana right there. Second scenario, again, from the most basic perspective, let's go over to straight arm bar, Juju Katami. So I'm mounting, and I have a strong guy that's going to push up on my chest and lock his arms out. He's trying to throw me off, right? Lock your arms out, Mason. Lock them out. From here, I'm going to place my hands and post off of his chest. As I post, I'm going to transition to the S mount. Look, I'm ready to isolate an arm here as I tilt. It's important to tilt when I do the arm bar. Look, if I just go here and try to kick the leg over, what happens? Look, I need to kick my partner or friend in the head, and I'm not even going to be able to transition to the arm bar effectively. It's important that I tilt my weight 